And the Chinese trade delegation is in Washington tonight for the resumption of those negotiations. Early word out of Beijing was that they plan to play hardball. But President Trump today wasn't tipping his hand about the U.S. strategy. Kayla Tauji reports. Talks with China reopened tonight after a dispute over the deal language has become public and vitriolic. President Trump is leaving his options open, praising Chinese leadership but scolding them for backing off their commitments. I have no idea what's going to happen. I did get last night a very beautiful letter from President Xi. Let's work together. Let's see if we can get something done. But they renegotiated the deal. Trump is moving to squeeze China even further, hiking tariffs on $200 billion in Chinese goods from 10 percent to 25 percent, effective at 12.01 a.m., and threatening the rest of China's imports, too. It'll be $325 billion at 25 percent, and we're starting that paperwork today. Trade isn't the only area the Trump administration is ramping up pressure. The Federal Communications Commission today denied China Mobile a license to do business in the U.S. and is looking at revoking licenses already granted to other Chinese-owned carriers. The security of our next generation networks cannot be an afterthought. It has to be a top-level priority now. As talks continue, tensions simmer. This round could prove to be a breakthrough or a breakup of the world's two biggest economic powers, battling over trade. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Kayla Tausche in Washington.